The Geoprobe 7822DT has been out for around 12 years, and it continues to be a workhorse in many fleets. If your 7822DT is getting a little older and could use some TLC, this video is for you. I'm Roman Burrows with Geoprobe Service, and today I'm going to talk about three key components to inspect on your Geoprobe 7822DT. The first key component we want to inspect is the probe slides. There are many slide systems on your 7822DT, but we're talking about the key slides that fit behind the head on which the head rides up and down. These are often referred to as the hockey pucks. Look at the top and the bottom of your head. Is there a gap between the head and the foot rail? If so, it's time to replace your hammer slides. We always recommend replacing the entire set and never one or two slides at a time. If needed, you may need to replace your trunnion slides, which run along the back side of the rail. The second key component we want to inspect is your hammer rotation assembly. Your hammer rotation assembly consists of a spindle with pressed on bearings. These bearings can wear out. Remove the anvil and retainer, which I've already done, and look up inside the hex assembly. Is it still hex shaped or is it rounded? If it's rounded, it may need to be replaced. Also inspect the outside of the spindle for cracks. If there are any cracks, it may need to be replaced. You can grab onto the outside of the spindle and try to wiggle. If it has any play at all, the bearings need replaced. As a note of caution, while you're inspecting your hammer rotation assembly, you never want to reach your hand up inside the spindle assembly. In doing so, you may come in contact with the hammer piston. It's important to maintain your spindle assembly even if you don't use it very often. We found that a worn out spindle assembly can adversely affect the hammering ability of your percussion cell. The third key component we want to inspect is your auger hoses, swivel fittings, and two-speed wiring. These components are out in the open and they receive a lot of wear and tear. They're in the weather, they can be hit with a with casing or with a swinging winch hook. Inspect your hoses. If they're scuffed, you need to be replaced, just like this one has been right here. These are high pressure hoses and very important to keep in good condition. Also inspect your swivel fittings. If they're leaking or seeping oil, you can remedy that with a simple seal kit or you can replace the entire fitting. You also need to inspect your two-speed wiring. If it's cut or frayed or the end has been hit with something, this needs to be resolved. If you have any questions about these components or any other component on your Geoprobe rig, you can call Geoprobe Service.